the number one trick all narcissists use. This is the narcissist's primary objective. It is the most important thing for them when they are dealing with you. And they will go above and beyond to achieve this. It is a cunning scheme which is intended to deceive you. It's intended to outwit you by creating an illusion. by creating a deceptive appearance or impression by planting a false idea or belief and this trick is designed to keep you under their influence and control it's designed to give them power over you by stripping away power that is rightfully yours but to do this, they have to get you to hand over your power to them. They have to make you believe that you are not deserving of your power. They have to make you believe that you are not worthy. And they do that by creating self-doubt. by making you lack confidence in yourself and your abilities. This is the number one trick all narcissists use. They have to do it. It's the only way that they can keep you as their source of supply. Because otherwise, you would realize that they're not bringing anything to the table. They're not doing anything for you. So to balance it out and to make you think that it's a fair exchange, they have to make you think that you're not doing much for them. They have to make you doubt yourself. And they do this by targeting your self-worth and self-esteem. Minimizing your accomplishments. Minimizing the value of anything you're doing for them. And comparing you to other people. This is how they lock you under their control. This is how they keep you as their personal workhorse. While you're not expecting anything in return from them. Because you are led to believe that you're not doing enough. You're led to believe that you need to do more for them. Before you can expect anything in return. They make you believe that there's something wrong with you. There's something wrong with what you're doing. And they do that. By never revealing their appreciation. By never showing you their gratitude. Even if they secretly admire your efforts. They cannot let you see it. Because then they would be letting you preside over them. They would be giving you the authority. Which wouldn't be of any use to them. Because they're weak. They're not really about anything. So the game is to make you doubt yourself so that you don't come to the conclusion that they ain't about shit. But now that you have this information, there is a way out of the maze. And that is through recognizing your worth, recognizing all of the work that you have put in, recognizing everything that you have accomplished.
If you look back and evaluate everything that you have done, you will see that you have done a lot more for them than they have done for you. You're more of an asset to them than they are to you. They need you more than you need them. But they can't let you know that because then that would put them at a disadvantage. It would make you look at them and then you would realize that they're not doing anything for you. So why would you keep them around if you know they're not about anything? Which is why they have to trick you into surrendering your power over to them. Because that is how they keep you under their control. That is how they prevent you from leaving. By making you think there's something wrong with you. Or by making you think you're not good enough. And there's really no limit to how they might carry this out. You could be a business owner or a celebrity. And you might have millions of customers or fans. But when you come home to the narcissist, you're nothing. You're not enough. You can't do anything right. Because they've already conditioned you into thinking you're less than them. They've distorted your beliefs about yourself. They've made you less confident. Narcissists want to be around powerful and successful people. They admire people like that. But they don't want you to use that same power on them. Because then you could tear them to smithereens. So instead they have to domesticate you. They have to tame you to their liking. Where they don't ever have to praise or compliment you. While still receiving all of the benefits and conveniences that you have to offer. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonates with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching.arcsurvivor.co.uk. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.